Hello, 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 OMG. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so, so much for clicking on this video. I'm so, so happy that you are here because today is CBS Day and I'm so, so excited. It's Jody Dunn and I'm coming at you with my amazing CBS haul that I am so dang excited to share with you. There's the sleepy boy. There's Gus hanging out. Case for any of y'all that like to see him. <laughs> I'm blocking him. Um, it was a day. OMG. It was a day. I made the decision. You know I'm doing the newbie series. So if you are a newbie couponer at CVS, I am doing a newbie series. So look out for week two. I'll be posting that, I think, tomorrow. And I made this decision that I was going to do all of my hauls all at once. <laughs> and I'm whipped. OMG, I'm whipped. And of course, you know, I made a couple of dang mistakes. Oh, I hate it when I do that. But I swear, like, there just is no couponing trip without mistakes. But it's fine. Because, you know, I'm wearing my grateful, thankful, blessed shirt. Because I am grateful. I am thankful. I am blessed. Even though I made a mistake in my math. Everything came off fine um, for this haul. I did have one digital coupon not come off on my next haul. But we're not going to talk about that one today. Um, but I made a mistake on my math because I had to switch a couple of things up in the store. That's going to happen it's fine because I use my rebate app, so I didn't actually pay any cash out of pocket, but because I figured my math wrong, I actually had a subtotal on one of them, but I got a product I am so, so excited to share with you. I've been wanting to try this product, and it is on promotion and giving back an extra buck, which is amazing. So a couple of quick updates before we get into the haul. I wanted to share with you, I did cash out to Swag Bucks for a $50 um, CVS gift card. That's going to last me for a while to cover my taxes and things. Um, unlike Ibotta and Fetch Rewards, it is not instant. So I'm learning Swag Bucks and sharing the updates with you. So I did already get an email that they are processing my request. But just so you are aware, um, sorry, somebody was driving by slowly. <laughs> just so you are aware, it is not instant. I mean, I will be in the store and I can cash out to CVS or um, I can cash out to Ibotta or Fetch just like that and get my gift card back. So Swagbucks is a little different. It did say that it can take up to 10 days. So we'll see. I'll keep you updated on how long it takes, but I'm glad to know that because... I, if I need something instantly, which I did today, I just cashed out to one of the other ones. Um, the other update is I will link in the description box the video where I did announce the gift card winners. One of them has claimed their prize. Yay! So excited for Yvette who chose a $25 CVS gift card. The other gift card winner of $25 has not claimed their prize yet. So hopefully by Thursday, I hear back. So if you did enter that giveaway, make sure you're checking that video. Otherwise, I will have to draw another winner. And then I did announce a special surprise giveaway last night where I did announce a $10 gift card winner um, that I drew from people that have used my link to sign up for Fetch Rewards. That person has not claimed their prize as of yet either. So if you have used my link to sign up for Fetch Rewards, please go watch that video and see if you were the winner so you can send me an email and claim your prize. So we did not have, I had a big money maker today on racers again, OMG. <laughs> I can't wait to share it with you. But the overall haul, was not a money maker today, but you're not going to believe what I got. Everything ended up working out to about like 61 cents, I think, a piece. I got some paper products. I got some big, big tides. OMG. I'm so excited to share this with you. 
As always, if you get some value out of this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed, I hope you do consider subscribing. And I think I totally forgot to say, but if you just happened upon my channel and you're new, would you please say hello and drop new right down there so I can say hi to you and welcome you. And if you are already a subscriber, I so appreciate you so much. I would love to hear how you're doing. How's the weather where you're at today? OMG, it's 90 some degrees here in Michigan and I'm freaking loving it. Yes, I'm sweating, but it's okay because I will tell you, ever since I lost, I lost over 70 pounds I can't get warm. Like, I can't stand the cold. So, I love the hot days now. I used to dread summer before because I would sweat profusely all the time. Part of that being because I I didn't own any, like, clothing that... I didn't own shorts. I didn't own leggings. I didn't, like, I covered my body from head to toe. So I absolutely always dreaded summer. Now I love summer and I'm like, bring on the heat. I freaking love it. All right, enough of me rambling on. Let's get into this amazing haul. I'm so excited to share it with you. All right, here it is. Oh my gosh, I'm so, so excited. I got a bunch of different things today than I normally pick up. And that always just gets me super duper excited, but I am super excited to share with you this new product that I have been so wanting to try. So let's go over each individual deal like we always do. I will include a printable breakdown list for you as well, listing where the coupons came from and what the deals would be, you know, individually. I did two separate transactions today because I actually went to two different stores because I wanted to get the beauty bag, which is not in this haul. The beauty bag will be in another haul. And my um, the store that I normally shop at doesn't have them. And I was so, so grateful that I went to the other store because that's what I found. Oh my gosh. But I was so whipped by the time. You're not going to believe this silly little mistake that I made. Oh my gosh. All right. So my first transaction basically includes... Everything except for this household bundle of Tide, Scott, the Kleenex, and the CoverGirl. That was in my second transaction. All right, so let's break the deals down. CoverGirl, great promotion on CoverGirl this week. It's buy any two, earn a $6 extra buck. I did get a $3 off any CoverGirl CRT. It was not a threshold-based CRT. I've actually seen a ton of people get them this week. So I picked up the brow pencils for $11.98. I used two $3 I coupons and that $3 CRT. I paid $2.98 for that and got back $6. So that was a money maker of $3.02. Hallelujah. I love money makers like that. The only other makeup that I picked up in this haul was the Alme blush. That is $12.49. I had a $2 paper coupon off of any face product. I had a $3 CRT that I got last week off of any Elme, and then I had a three off 12 cosmetic CRT, so I paid $4.49 for that, and I got back a $4 extra buck, so a cost of $4. The Speed Stick is on promotion this week for buy one, get one half price, and when you buy two, you get a $2 extra buck. So both of those together cost $5.08. I used two 50 cent printable coupons from speedstick.com, and then I had a CRT for a dollar off when you buy two speed stick. And it could have been men's or women's. I chose the women's. So I paid $3.08. I got back $2. So final cost on that one of $1.08 or just $0.54 cents each. I was really kind of bummed. Real quick, we'll go over this deal. Not a deal at all. I just had a CRT that was expiring. That cost $5.99. I had the $2 paper coupon from our May p &G. I had a $2 CRT off any Always Radiant. And then I had a 50 cent app only coupon. So that brought that down to $1.49. That's why I picked that up because it is a product that we actually need in the house. So for $1.49, I thought that was a great deal. I was kind of bummed that I could not pick up the Pantene this week. I mean, I could have, but I would have paid way more than I wanted to because I've already used my digital coupons and we don't have any paper coupons on it. But the Aussie was included in on the deal, so I was pretty excited about that. 
I actually thought it was going to be a money maker for me, but that's the problem when you have multiple cards that you're working with. The CRT that I thought was on my card was on another card. It's totally fine. Still a pretty decent deal. So those are buy one, get one 40% off. Um, I picked up one that was $4.39 and the other ones are $3.99. So for all three of them with the one at 40% off, it costs $10.77. CVS gave us a $2 digital coupon. How very nice of them. And then I had a $2.25 off of 10 hair care CRT. So that brought me down to paying $6.52 for the three bottles of Aussie there. And I got back a $5 extra buck. So final cost of $1.52 are just 50 cents each. So pretty great stock up price. No promotion at all on the Suave. I picked it up for a couple of reasons. Um, number one, the shelter that I like to donate to is always looking for body wash. So I picked up three body washes. They are $2.29 each, I think, in my store. I had a CRT for two off when you purchase two Suave. And then I had a two off six body wash CRT. So I ended up paying $2.87 cash out of pocket for those will not cash out of pocket because you know I used extra bucks and my gift card for um my rebate gift cards but $2.87 for those but I bought it is giving us back 50 cents on each one of them so um with a limit of five I think so I'm gonna get a dollar back from these and then I'm gonna get 50 cents back from the men's so bringing that down to just a cost of $1.37 or 45 cents each, I think that's perfect. And I'm always looking for how do I get a deal on body wash to be able to donate if it's not a body wash that I use. All right, let's go over to the L'Oreal. I almost wasn't gonna pick this up and I still kind of am like, mm, should I really have picked it up? But I did, I went ahead and picked it up. Next week it's on promotion for spend 25 or any $5 extra buck. So that is not what we are used to seeing. So this week it is on promotion, spend 30, earn a $10 extra buck. We have no manufacturer coupons for this at all. Um, I think we did have a $2 one, but it expired on Sunday. So both of those together cost me $29.78 and I was kind of excited about this one. Like I suffer from under eye bags, so like I'm excited to try this one. And I picked up the cleanser. I had a $6 off any Age Perfect CRT that attached to that one. And then I had a $6 off when you spend 25 on L'Oreal Facial Care. So that ended up costing $17.78, but I got a $10 extra buck back. So final cost of $7.78 or $3.89 each. But you know, because I spent $30, I'm gonna earn $3 back in Beauty Buck Rewards. So really, truly, it only cost $4.78 for both of those products. So not too terrible. I picked up some candy. I swear it wouldn't be a week of couponing without oral care and candy. But guess what you don't see in this haul? No oral care. OMG. Don't worry, it's in my next haul. <laughs> if you were like, what's going on? You didn't pick up oral care. It's in the next haul. I just didn't do it on this card, okay? But I did pick up candy. The Reese singles are on sale and there's a whole variety of different ones you can choose from for two for a dollar. And when you buy two, you get a dollar extra buck back. Now we do have a dollar digital coupon that did not come off for me, but it did come off for me on one of my cards. And I, I will be bringing you that haul, I think tomorrow, just in case, which makes them a freebie. Now I did pick up four, the limit is one. I picked up four because I had a CRT for $2 off when you spend seven on candy. So this is also on promotion for two, it's on sale for $2.99 and when you buy one, you get a dollar extra buck. So for all of the candy, that brought me to $6.99 for those five things of candy. Um, and I used my $2 off seven candy CRT, so I had to pay $4.99, but then I got back $2 in extra bucks making that a final cost of just $2 for five of these. So pretty fantastic. All right, let's talk about the super exciting ones. First of all, here we go again with the dang Schick, a love you Schick. 
This is an unadvertised deal, just means it wasn't placed in the ad, but it is on promotion when you buy any two, and it's women's or men, you get a $10 extra buck back. I picked up these ones because I got a CRT for $4 off of Schick Hydro refills, but the refill CRT was attaching to only these ones. Cause you know, I always scan. I scan and check in my app to see, do I have CRTs that are attaching? So those two were $11.49 each. So they, they came to $22.98. I used two $4 off paper coupons. CVS also gave us a dollar app only coupon off of Schick. How wonderful. I used that $4 CRT and I had a $5 off when you spend 20 on Shave Needs. So I paid $4.98 for those two razors. I got back $5 in, or I got back $10, making that a $5.02 money maker. So love when we have money makers like that that help us pay for the things we really want. So let's talk about the thing I really wanted. OMG. This. I have been wanting to try this. Flawless bras. Now, I have the Finishing Touch Flawless Facial Hair Remover. I have had it for, I think, two years now. That thing is fantastic for getting rid of the little hairs above my lip because I'm not trying to walk around with the dang mustache. It helps get rid of the peach fuzz that I have on my face. I freaking love that thing. So I have been wanting to try the brow tool. Well, they are all on special this week. They're not on sale, but they're on special. When you buy one, you get a $5 extra buck. So this baby is $19.99. You guys, we got a dang manufacturer coupon out of one of the inserts for $2 off. So I used the manufacturer coupon for $2 off. And I used... Last week, I got a 5 of 20 shave needs. That's what I used on this. This week, I got another 5 of 20 shave needs. Guess what attached to this? My 5 of 20 shave needs. How fantastic is that? So, $7 off in coupons. That left me to pay $13, $12.99 because it's $19.99. I got back a $5 extra buck, so final cost of $7.99. Pretty dang excited because this is something I've really been wanting to try. And what a better way to pick it up than when it's on promotion and giving something back. And I would I paid $20 for my other one. So now for this one, I only had to pay $8. So I'm super duper excited about that. Let me know if you use the Finishing Touch Flawless line at all. I, I tried the leg hair remover. I don't care for that one. But the facial hair remover is fantastic and I've heard great things about the brow one. So super duper excited about that. So that was transaction one. Let us take a look at the receipt here. All right, there are my Reese's at a dollar each, two for two, so there's four of them. There's my big bag of Kit Kats on sale for $2.99. There's my Lady Speed Stick, buy one, get one half price. There's my Aussie, buy one, get one 40% off. I got three of them. There is the L'Oreal Cleanser for $8.29. There are both of my razors for $11.49. There's my Almay Blush. There is my Finishing Touch Flawless Brow. There is that um, Age Perfect Eye Gel. There is, what the heck is that? Oh, my Always Pads for $5.99. And then the Three Suave Body Wash. So I used a $2 paper coupon for Elme, $4 for both of the Schick razors. Um, I'm looking, what the heck was 50 cents? Oh, 50 cents off of my speed stick. $2 off from the Finishing Touch Flawless Brow. My $2 digital came off from Aussie. What was the other $2 one? Oh, the paper coupon for the um, always. Ugh. All right, there's my six off 25 L'Oreal Facial. My six off of Age Perfect Moisturizer. My five off of 20 any shave needs. They both came off because I spent over $40 in shave needs. 
my four off of Chic Hydro Refills, my three off Elmay Cosmetics, my three off 12 Cosmetics, my 225 off 10 Hair Care, my two off seven Candy, my two off six Body Wash, my two off of Tampax, Tampax are always radiant, my two off two Suave Body Wash, my one off two Speed Stick, there is my app only coupon for a dollar off of Chic Razors and my app only coupon for um, the always. And then I used my extra bucks to pay and I had a dang subtotal, OMG. I did my dang math wrong, but you can see I used my gift card to pay. It's fine. I think when I was adding it up, cause I was wanting to pick up this transaction um, at that store as well. And they didn't have the paper products, so. Um, I think I forgot to add in the candy, which was $5, because I was thinking my subtotal was going to be a dollar. So I think that's what happened. So let's take a look at what I got back. I got back a dollar from the Hershey's Kisses. I got back a dollar from the Hershey's Singles. And that is the Hershey's Kisses right there. Um, reward for that one. I got two from the Ladies Speed Stick. I got five from the Aussie. I got 10 from the L'Oreal Facial Care. I got 10 from the Chic, love you Chic. And I got five from the Finishing Touch. I also got four from the Alme and I rolled it into my next transaction. The silly thing is, is I still had $13 in extra bucks. <laughs> but you know, you don't add stuff after they hit total and finish because it will screw everything up. I've talked about this several times and I will tell you, and I've, I've told you guys this several times, you have to be ready with CVS. Your extra bucks are coded in the system as coupons. So you can't wait for them to hit total and then give extra coupons. I know we use those as cash, but you gotta have your totals ready. So <clears throat> once he hit total and I was like, oh crap, I must have done my math wrong. And sure enough, I did. I was just like, I'm not gonna mess with it because we would have to void the whole transaction. And I will tell you, it was the manager that checked me out today. And he literally said to me, you are such a pleasure to ring up because you always have everything ready and everything goes smoothly. So please do not be that couponer that doesn't have their paperwork ready. At CVS, you have to be ready because your extra care bucks are coupons. Just like you would not have them hit total and then say, oh, wait, I have a coupon for Tide. And then you would have them hit total and say, oh, wait, I have a coupon for CoverGirl. No, you have your coupons ready. Well, your extra bucks are coupons. You've got to have that ready. All right. So this was transaction number two. Let me move this stuff so you know exactly what transaction number two was. And I will show you the very silly mistake I made. Oh, I was just tired by this point. <laughs> <laughs> and I was so excited that I found this because this was going to be such a fantastic deal. So I already told you about the cover girl. All right. So the household deal is spend 30, earn a $10 extra buck. So what I got, let me see, where did I write it down? I swear I wrote it down. Yes. Um, everything I got here, these were on sale for $11.94. These are the big guys, the 92 ounces. They had no 100 ounces. So I got the 92 ounces. Um, the Scott is on sale for $5.49 and we do have digital coupons for 50 cents off and the Kleenex is on sale two for three and you can see, uh, hello, I got one. OMG. It's fine. My Kleenex was $2.49, you guys, and it was on sale two for three and I only got one. <laughs> I was tired. That should tell you how tired I was. So everything totaled $31.86. Now, this is why I talk about you need to have Care Pass because it comes in handy. Oh my gosh, so I was able to make such a fantastic deal with this. I used a paper coupon from our May PNG for $2 off one Tide. I used a digital coupon off of the other. I had a 50 cent digital coupon for Scott that did not come off. I don't know why. And no coupons for the Kleenex. And I should have just picked up dang two of them. And then I picked up the CoverGirl. I already told you the deal, but basically the household deal. Oh, and I had a $3 off when you spend 15 in laundry care. A lot of people got that one last week. So I used it on this. So that brought everything down to $24.86 for the household deal. And then I used my $10 care pass that I've already paid for 
months ago. So that brought me down to only having to pay $14.86 for this, and I got back a $10 extra buck. What the what? Such a fantastic deal. All right, let's take a look. There's my Kleenex for $2.49. I don't know, Jody. Why didn't you pick up two for three? Pay an extra dang 50 cents. Oh, there's my Tide on sale for $11.94 each. There's my Scott paper towel for $5.49. And then my two cover girls. So I used a $2 paper coupon for Tide, a $3 for the cover girl, a $3 for the cover girl. I had a $2 off digital coupon for Tide, my three off 15 laundry, my three off fifth or just three off CoverGirl, no threshold, just three off CoverGirl. And then I used my Care Pass plus um, $17 in extra bucks. My subtotal was 44 cents, OMG. And I got back, look at what it did. Oh, it's doing that sometimes. $10 from the spend 30, get um, 10, and $6 from CoverGirl. So dang excited about this haul. Oh my gosh, all right. So again, I told you this was not a moneymaker. So I started off today with $66 in extra bucks. I am ending now with 50, so that is a loss of 16, but I'm gonna get $6 back in extra bucks within 48 hours because I spent just over 60 in beauty. So I'm going to end with 56. OMG, I got a dang phone call from a telemarketer. Oh, sorry. All right, I don't know where I was at. But after I get my beauty bucks, I'm going to end with $56. So that's a loss of $10 in extra bucks, not cash out of my pocket, just extra bucks. But we still count that because that's basically how we pay for everything at CVS. Plus, I did have that subtotal of $16. I didn't pay that cash out of pocket, but we're going to count that. So $16 would be my cost for all 24 of these items making everything just 61 cents each. What? I am so in love with this haul. Tide, are you kidding? The 92 ounce for 61 cents. Scott paper towel, six equals 11. This is not even the six equals seven that we get from Walgreens. This is six equals 11 for 61 cents. And to try my new flawless brow so dang excited all right i would love to hear what you are picking up this week at cvs if you are going out if you have something that you wanted to pick up really such a great week this week at walgreens and cvs to stock up on laundry care needs so so excited i always get excited when i can get big huge tides for super duper cheap and the big packs of paper towel. All right, I would love to hear what you are picking up. If you are going out, let me know in the comments. I always love to hear your guys' deals because sometimes I'm like, oh my gosh, I totally need that and I forgot about it or I didn't know about it or it could help somebody else. And that's it. If you got some value, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. I so appreciate you. I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day and I will see you tomorrow.